Hi guys, welcome back. This is episode two of Stray. I'm picking up uh, pretty much exactly where I left off um, from the previous episode where we got to here and these lovely people. So I'm probably just going to chat to these people, see if there's anything else I can figure out from them. I know I have to go and see Momo where that orange sign is right up there. So that's my target where I will be going, but in the meantime, Let's have a look around. Guardian, okay. What have you got to say? You look lost. What do you need? Uh, show item. I think I showed you this already, didn't I? But we'll do it again. Oh, a picture of the outside. Ridiculous. Mm, whatever. The elevator isn't operational. Everyone knows that it is impossible to leave this place. Well, except the outside. But they're all going except the memo. Yes. Okay. Okay. Wrap it up. Wrap it up. Okay, so in the interest of fairness, I will destroy your carpet too. Oh, you guys look sad. Joris, you gave us such a fright. We thought you were a zerk. Mm, very pretty. Oh, thanks for your help. Ronin. You really thought you'd take the elevator? I've I've never seen that thing work and I'll be 374 years old tomorrow. Damn Ronin. Such a beautiful dream. Dream, what a shame, it's just a dream. Oh, you're a bundle of joy, aren't you? Why go up there? There's nothing there. I think Momo has some pictures just like this. Did you show it to him? Not yet, no. I, d I didn't. Uh, oof, oof, oof. Thanks, Johan. Mm, please don't interrupt my meditation with strange- Oh, you're meditating. My apologies, I didn't mean to mock your meditation there. <laughs> I thought you were just in distress. down here. Oh, look at these. Translate. Okay. The marketplace. Cool. Oh, the, I'm a merchant of the market. You give me something and I'll give you something in exchange. It's as simple as that. This is an ancient relic. A testament to the, the talent of our ancestors. It will cost you three energy drink cans. I can't do less. What about this? No, nope, sorry, I won't accept that. Good, I need it. I don't want you to have it. This is a set of electrical, electrical cable. The best on the market. The exchange for this, for a super spirit detergent, that's the best I can do. Okay. Music sheet. Massive piece of art 
of a very renowned artist. It will cost you one energy drink. Can't do less. Let's have a look. Yep, Cardi B. I can see it right there. Okay, well, it looks like I can collect things and bring them to this market. Leto. We're fortunate to have these items to help us defend against the Zerks. The slums has its threats and preparation is key. Um, okay. Very cool. Right, well I was going to see Momo. If I see any of that stuff they were talking about, I can always pick it up and bring it back there. But in the meantime, how do I get up there? Let's try this way. Come on, Meta, we can do this. I'm so dexterous and fluffy. Ugh. Well, you're not anything good, are you? Hey, can I jump over there? Yes, I can. Hey. Please don't, please don't bother Vapora. She's so clumsy. That's got to be Vapora over there. Can I knock any of this stuff out? Oh, I, um, I mean, I've got to now, don't I? Before I go and visit Momo. Vapora. Hello. Careful, I need to focus. I don't want to drop another bucket. Hang on a minute. I can meow here. Come on. Oh no. Can't say I'm sorry, really. Hello. Sorry about that. Butterfingers. Whoops. Yeah, I would say so. Okay, so where am I going? Right up there. That's where I need to get to. How do I get up there? Is the question. Ooh, what's this? Hello. Twenty-two. Those circles of light are pleasing to watch, but I want to see the real sky one day. You and me both, friend. The outside. Momo told me he'd get me there one day. Right, let's... Can I get over here? Yes, I can. Oh, I see a way. Oh, here it is. Is this it? <gasps> Momo. Okay. So you got to save yourself. It's never going to work. Why did I let them go? I'm all alone now. Hey you, what do you want? Calm down, Momo. This is a picture of the outside. You... Do you want to go there? Oh, don't bother. It's a waste of time. It will bring you only loneliness and despair. My friends had this dream too. But now they're gone. And I'm all alone. I don't know where they ended up. I tried to contact them, but that something something transceiver doesn't work. Oh, okay. That <coughs> transceiver doesn't work. <laughs> My friend and I took notes of our research about the outside here. Take mine if you really want to go out there. Ooh, no book. You're on your own. I'm done with the outside. Good luck. <laughs> 
Momo seems very sad he misses his friends. Yeah, no shears. Let me check the notebook he gave us. The Outsider's Manifesto. We must go outside at any cost. We must protect our brothers and sisters. We must stay away from the Zerks. It's signed Clementine. Uh, what's that? Baltazar for the Silent Z, I'm guessing. Duck and Momo. It looks like Momo's name was added later. <gasps> Momo. I think we should find other notebooks. Yeah, I think you're right. Anything up here? Mm. Hang on a minute, that was a lot being said there. Okay, there is a level above ours. This it seems to have a ceiling. If I believe my books, a big blue sky is hidden behind it. Okay. I love the music. Ooh, look at this. Man, man, I'm sorry. Yeah, carpet is ruined. I'm not sorry. Sorry, not sorry. Okay, what else is in here? Oh, look. Oh, I can't. I can't control it. I've got no idea. Because I got a bag on my head. <laughs> uh, like, I'm using the controls now, and it's because I've got a bag on my head, it's not allowing me to do anything. Interesting. In here, anything good? Oh, what's this? <gasps> Sheet music! Yes! I found something. Cool. That looks about it for that room. What's in here? Why does a robot need a fridge? What's he got in here? I don't know, because it's blurring it. That's okay. Right, where else have we got in here? Oh, where the magic happens. Ah, back home too. I remember this video game. It was made just after I was created, I think. I can't, I can't remember it well. The scientists and I spent a lot of time playing it. It was fun. I miss him. Why can't I remember his name? Oh, memory found. Memo, let me see your memories, please. Oh, it's just that. Cool. Anything that's cool in here? Excuse me. Anything more with Momo? Ah, music sheet. I don't play an instrument, sorry. Well, you're helpful. Okay, well it looks like there's nothing else in here that I can see. And I can't seem to get up there, so... I guess I'm moving on with my life. I guess I'm moving on. You're not allowed music, you're supposed to be sad. Okay, well I guess we're getting out of here then. Oh, what's this? Outsiders! Huzzah! Oh, hang on a minute. What's that? Third. This is third. Planet from the sun and fifth largest in the solar system by mass and diameter. To date is the only celestial object known to foster life. According to radiometric dating, the Earth is 4.54 billion years old. It has a single natural satellite, the moon, which forms soon after. The gravitational interaction with the moon creates a tide, stabilizes the Earth's axis of rotation, and gradually reduces the rotation of speed. Cool.
Okay. Oh, I can scratch your door too. All right. Okay, Momo, um, I'm not really sure what else I can get from you because you've been a bit of a bore, so see ya. The symbol on the wall matches one on the notebook. <sighs> oh, yes it does. Guess that's where I'm going. Seems like a lead. Yes, it does. Let's get over there. Bucket trip. Whee! Sorry. I'm a clumsy cat. A clumsy kitty, so to speak. Oh, what have we got here? Hmm. No more. No, I've arrived. Anything in here? Hey, look. What's this? Music sheet. All right. What's that music sheet number two? Can't wait to gather all the information, musical information for Cardi B's song. That's gonna be awesome. <laughs> Ooh, interesting. Take Clementine's note. Oh, yes, I will. Perfect. And outside his notebook is the same logo as the one Momo gave us. This one seems to belong to someone named Clementine. Everything is going according to plan. They managed to contact the upper level before the transceiver went down. They are in a place called Midtown and apparently it's controlled by some kind of oppressive force. I talked to Momo earlier. His, his eyes. I know this look. He will not come with us. Let's find the other notebooks. I'm a, I'm agreed with you, B. Let's um. Let's try and find these other notebooks. Okay, I can't see anything else highlighted in here. So where would these other notebooks be? That's the question. Maybe if I. Took this notebook I just found back to Momo. See if he's got anything to say for himself. Let's have a look sees. Yo Mo. Come on. Come on. Momo. Found one. Hey, look out! You still looking for those notebooks? I found one. Oh, you found Clementine's note. He was really brave, you know—the most fearless person I ever met. Okay. Okay. Well, thanks for your help, Momo. Thanks for nothing. Now, where to go? Can I see any? Oh, what's that over there? That's something. Oh. Nearly a catastrophe there. Hey. Hey. Pal. Buddy. Ooh. Oh, what's this? Can I watch TV? Yes! News! Breaking news! What is this breaking news?
It looks like robots have been around for a while. They're on TV. And you know, if something's on TV, it can be trusted. Okay, there's a guy down there too. Is <laughs> that like daytime television selling stuff? That's good. That's a nice touch. Okay, what have we got here? This looks interesting. Oh. Wow. Look at this place. What's this? How to develop your artificial intelligence in order to be creative as a real human. Oh, that's sad. Poor guy. <gasps> Cheap music! With a piano! Oh dear. That sounds awful. That's a cool piece of art. I like that. got here. Hey Doc, I found the keys to your save. You need to be more careful with these. Oh, keys. It's not enough to bury your safe behind a bunch of books. Just a librarian. Okay, so there's a safe somewhere. I need to try and locate that. My thoughts exactly, Murdoch. Ah, uh, uh, yeah, that's it. That feels bad. Sometimes you just gotta do that. So, where are we going? Bridge? Like, I wonder, I wonder what year, given the technology that's here and the size of these monitors, that, um, this robot thing happened? Or have they always been here? That's a hard one to know. And it, oh, it looks like I can get up somewhere. And what's that? What is that? Here we go. Ah, oh, look at me, I'm going to sleep! Now that is cute. That's a nice touch. With the little cat sleeping, Murtok sleeping. sound. An awful sound. Okay, so it looks like I can get up somehow, I just don't know how. Work another notebook. All right. This one seems to belong to someone named Duck. After weeks of research, I've combined a spectrometer with a powerful UV lamp. With this, we should be capable of warding off Zerks on our way out. 
the initial attempt was explosive, I might have to test it under real conditions. Let's find the other notebooks. And don't mind if I do. Let's go. Right, so there was a guy down here I wanted to see. See a guy about a cat. Hey, what's this? Hey, take energy drink. Don't mind if I do. So that's where you get them from. Those things. Okay, I'll keep an eye out for those. You look reputable. Hello. Hepta. Oh. Hey, it's you. You do look weird and small, but there's something about you. I feel compelled to pet you, but I won't because of... Because I don't understand why. Interesting. Okay. Let's let you... Sheet music, Momo's notebook, energy drink. You wanna look at this? There's a logo with the outsiders. There are a group of people looking for the surface. Momo is one of them. One day they decided to put their plan into action and went into the sewers, sadly. Not a peep from them since. But for some reason Momo stayed behind. I think he'll always regret that decision, poor guy. Uh, anything else you can look at? This one? We'll go with the outsiders. Yes, okay. Okay. Wrap it up. Wrap it up. Okay, so it seems that, like, people do know about this, um... Struggles of Momo. He seems to be well known around here. The so Momo is over there. Hey, is that another one of those things over there? Let's have a look. Excuse me, coming through. Pardon me. Important business. Okay, so I need to go around. Easy enough. Uh, back up here again, I guess. Eh? I guess. Here we jump. Don't be afraid. Perfect. Here we go. I just I walked right past that, didn't I as well? What a silly bow billy. Say now, how do I get in there? Oh Bucket. I knew it. Is there a bucket anywhere? Whee! They, they fly, don't they? Let's have a look at this. Doink! Sorry! Oh, here we go. Ventilation power supply. Not for long. Ooh! we got here. Oh, thank you. Always staying hydrated. Excellent. Oh, anything on here? Nope. What's this? I love that! I love that! Great picture. Okay, anything else in here before I go through that suspicious looking door? Not that I can see. Again, let's just give a shout out to the people who made this game. It's a beautiful game. Like, 
like I said in the first episode, very atmospheric, very, you know, you really do feel like you're a part of this world. The grime and the, the robots. <gasps> and a drinks machine! Can I get to that? So I can get down, I can get back up. What's this? Remember. Remarkable. Companions have evolved, evolved so much. In the early days, the simple AI merely intimidated it. It Im... something. Uh, imitated, intimidated. Ah, I couldn't even think of the word. What's happening to me? Now all this. Now this is all their own. Humans often said that making art is important in desperate situations. There are, there are certainly desperate times. Oh, new memory recovered. Cool. Now, where's my drink? I will ask when I'm ready to ask. Like now. I think the outsiders seem to live in the upper flats. We won't find anything in these narrow streets. You might not, but I know what I will find. Energy drinks. We saw at that marketplace. Now oh, look at this sad sack. Ah, uh, hello. Hello, I'm a musician, but I don't have any songs. Uh, I've got music. Petite Valse. Sounds cool. Here. Yeah. Watch that. Okay. I might have a little oh, oh, rest while you play that lovely song. Thank you so much. Okay, thanks, bruh. That was cool. You can stop now. Oh no. Oh no, my worst nightmare. My greatest adversary. A bag. Help me, musician man. Help me, please. I've been... I'm stuck in a bag. Ah, uh, ah, uh, they're perfect. Right, anything... Good down here? What's this? Access to the sewers is condemned because of proliferation of Zerk. Stay safe. Stay in the safe zone. Oh uh, yes, yes. Oh, what's this? Take safe's mysterious password. Use digicode. I don't know what the digicode is. B12. Okay, you have that weird passcode thing? Safe's passcode, examine. Uh, I, oh, um, it's all ones and zeros and stuff. I don't know what the passcode is. How would you figure it out? Is there anything here that says what it is? I reckon it's probably a part of some upper flat thing. Yes, I will go with that. Oh, I'm back where I started. But not for long. Alright, so we are going to do that thing, gimme jiggy. Let's get back all the way up here. Um, I 
Okay, so it was through there, wasn't it? So, you know what? I think I might have. Um, probably gone through it maybe already without realizing. Let's drop down here. And let's go through that window now. And see where it takes me. Is it where I thought? I think it might be. Well, that was kind of pointless, wasn't it? What the... chuff was that about? How worthless to me. Okay, let's look around here. I've been in that one. That apparently went nowhere. I feel like I'm missing something. What am I missing here? Can't get over there. Already translated this, haven't we? Yeah. Well, why would nothing be in here? That's what I want to know. Hey, wait a minute. What's this? Yes, here we go. Almost left that behind. Finally, the last notebook. Huzzah! This one seems to belong to someone named um, Balthazar. All traces of organic life has disappeared except for what we call the Zergs. They seem to eat almost anything that moves and breed at an inconceivable rate. As if being locked in the city wasn't hard enough. Oh well. There's also a note in this book. It says I've found a design flaw in the transceiver, but I think I figured out how to fix it. Here's the equation. With this, we should be able to help Momo repair the trans transceiver. Ah, oh, yes! Yes! If I can communicate with the upper levels, that could be our way up. Let's show them what we found. Uh, let's. Let's do this. And obviously this is my exit. It points me in the right direction. To Momo! Yeah, if I remember cor correctly. Hey, Momo! Hang on a minute. Meow. Meow. Hey, little guy, you still looking for those um, useless notebooks? No, because I found them all. I found this one. Okay, I found this one. I did! I did! Oh, what's the note? The transceiver can be repaired. This is incredible! That means we should be able to communicate outside of the slums. Clementine, Balthazar, Duck, I'm sorry I doubted our cause. I'll promise you, I'll find a way to reach the surface. Thank you, we might be able to find you a way up. Okay, let's fix this piece of junk transceiver. Ah, oh, cutscene. Et voila, it works! Come with me! Am I gonna get a saucer of milk? Up there, see that building high above the others? Uh, with the lights? Yes, yeah, sure. If you install a transceiver at the very top of that tower, we should be able to communicate with the whole city. My friends still might be out there. If there is a way out, they'll know it. 
Ooh, transceiver. You're the only one small and quick enough to evade the Zergs. We need you, little outsider. Bring us the sky! Okay guys, we found all the notebooks, we found some musical notes, we figured out where to get energy drinks from, we've lifted Mermo's spirits, and we've got a new target, that building way up there in the next episode. Um, like if you like it, and I will see you soon. So that's from me, and Murtox will say his own goodbyes. Thank you Murtox, and I'll see you later.